The fate of accused triple murderer Sean Kratz is now in the hands of a jury. Yesterday, the defense and prosecution wrapped up their closing arguments. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo is at the Bucks County Courthouse with the story. In closing arguments yesterday at the Bucks County Courthouse, Sean Kratz's defense attorney told the jury he killed because he was manipulated by his cousin Cosmo DiNardo. But prosecutors pointed out that when questioned, Kratz repeatedly lied to police about the killings. A jury of 12 men and women are now deliberating inside the Bucks County Courthouse after four days of testimony in the murder trial of Sean Kratz. He's accused of killing three men, 19-year-old Dean Finacaro, 21-year-old Thomas Mayo, and 22-year-old Mark Sturgis on a Solbury Township farm in 2017. Authorities say the three men were lured to the farm to buy marijuana, but instead, Kratz and his cousin, Cosmo DiNardo, shot them dead, then stuffed their bodies into a pig row and tried to set them on fire. During closing arguments Tuesday, prosecutors told the jury the three victims would still be alive if not for Kratz. But Kratz's defense attorney, Charles Peruto, shot back during his closing argument, saying Kratz killed out of fear for his own life because his cousin, Cosmo DiNardo, had power over him. Meantime, DiNardo was expected to testify against Kratz, but he never did. In another surprise, Kratz's defense attorney had said at the start of the trial, Kratz would take the stand, but that didn't happen either. And Sean Kratz's cousin, Cosmo DiNardo, confessed to those killings. He's now serving a life sentence. Meantime, the jury here at the Bucks County Courthouse could come back with a verdict with Sean Kratz's case at any minute. In Doylestown, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. And as soon as there is a verdict in the murder tri trial, we will bring it to you here on CBSPhilly.com. We'll also have the latest developments from the courtroom beginning today on CBS 3 at 4.